an American Jew and I can stand to see genocide committed in our name. And I feel strongly that, and the world feels strongly that what's happening in Palestine is unjust. Just because historically our people have experienced harm does not give us the right to perpetuate that same harm on others. Do you think um, that there are many Jewish people in the United States and also in Israel who feel the way that you do? I do. I think that unfortunately our voices are smaller and we are not given the same platform as Zionist Jews. And so that's why it's incredibly important that we're here today and show up and show the world that not all Jews feel like Zionists do and that we believe in humanity and that everyone has access to live safely and with liberation. What do you think about this campaign that tries to smear everyone who's opposed to Israel's politics and the genocide is anti-Semitic? I think that's why it's incredibly important for Jews across the world, and especially American Jews, to speak out against the occupation and speak in support of the freedom and safety of Palestinians because criticizing Israel does not make it anti-Semitic. Accuse people who speak out against Zionism or against the occupation as being anti-Semitic undermines our concept of Judaism or identities fundamentally. I think it's anti-Semitic to say that in itself. Um, and it's really unfortunate that so many people are so fearful of being accused of that just because of um, how frequently that statement is used. And how do you feel about the role of the Biden administration in this? Uh, it's incredibly disappointing to see so many politicians be so fearful of critiquing Israel that they're willing to allow thousands of people to be massacred.